Hi again, Megan. The file set you found at Home Depot, it looks like it comes out from here 8.46 inches. The other one that you found, uh, it comes out even more so nine inches and nine inches uh, from here, uh, from the wall, it will be even more. So I did not do the calculations based on that. I don't think I don't think this will work for you. So I did it based on this, just uh, you know, eight point uh, eight point forty six inches. So your brick tile is about uh, nine sixteenth thick, uh, based on the information they provided on the website. With your grout, I think it will be more like th about three quarters. And if your faucet mounts to that uh, brick. It will come up from here, 8.46. I drew, I drew a line here. This is 8.46, about eight and a half. So your question was, this is the same drawing I did uh, because your uh, framing would not be any different. Your question was, if you can move the sink backwards, which you can technically move it as much as this much, but then your faucet, the water will land here which is not what you would like. Ideally, you would like the faucet to go as close as possible to the drain. And it would leave you a very big room in the back. So I don't think this is ideal too. So one of two things you can do is you can find a faucet where the reach is actually smaller than this, you know, smaller than 8.46, it can help. Uh, the other thing you can do is if you go with like a uh, bigger sink, then I think the drain hole will be a little bit uh, towards the back that can help uh, a little bit too.